Welcome to Free to Cook. In this episode, we're going to be cooking Tuscan Spiced Lemon Chicken. This spice blend is packed full of flavor and when mixed with the lemon, makes for some delicious chicken. To start off, we're going to make the spice blend. In a small bowl, add one tablespoon of ground fennel seeds. Then four tablespoons of dried basil. Next, three tablespoons of garlic powder. Followed by one tablespoon of salt and one tablespoon of freshly ground black pepper. Then two tablespoons of dried rosemary. Finally, two tablespoons of dried oregano. Mix it all together. In a large bowl, add your chicken. I'm using chicken thighs with a bone in and skin on, but you can use chicken breast if you like. Cut across the skin, this will help the flavors penetrate the chicken. Add the spice blend to the bowl. Next, squeeze the juice of one lemon into the bowl. Please make sure you use fresh lemon if you can. Finally, add half a cup of olive oil. This will help the spices stick to the chicken. Mix the chicken through the spice blend, lemon and olive oil. Make sure each piece is fully coated. Let it marinate in the fridge for at least an hour to two hours. The longer you leave it, the better the flavor. I've set up my barbecue with charcoal to one side. I'm using clean heat charcoal. It burns nice and hot and for a really long time. Sear the outside of the chicken before placing it on the other side of the barbecue. We're gonna finish cooking these chicken thighs indirect. Brush the remaining marinade from the bowl over the chicken. Cover with the lid and let the chicken cook until it reaches a temperature of 165 Fahrenheit or 75 Celsius. Once the thighs are fully cooked through, they're ready to serve. There you have it, Tuscan Spice Lemon Chicken. I've served mine with some chimichurri. I know it's not traditional, but it works well with this dish. You can find my recipe for chimichurri on the channel. This blend of spices is packed full of flavor and when mixed with the lemon, makes for some delicious chicken. If you found this recipe helpful, don't forget to share it, subscribe to the channel, like us on Facebook, follow us on Instagram, and if you have any recipe suggestions, leave them in the comments.